Hey y'all, hey! Welcome back to the Mom Nurse Fashionista. Hey y'all, hey! So if you come to my channel, you're probably here because I'm talking about easy ways for you to get like definite ways for you to get this job okay um so um if you don't know <clears throat> my channel is normally about nursing stuff but this channel is for everybody because this season has been something else in my life and you know i gotta go ahead and get this on this month i work 12 hour shifts i have four kids i'm a single mom and so you know along with all of that that means somebody gotta be there to take my kids to school and pick them up so currently right now in my life it's two days after christmas merry christmas and happy new year to all of you i am currently in a state where i am sorry about the video being to the side i got y'all all on a roller coaster but um my car was stolen so this is not my car that i'm riding in unfortunately um my house i may have to move out my house and my help right now that i currently have they're um progressing on and doing something awesome for their future and so i'm not going to have any help with my kids for my 12 hour shifts so because of that and because of me might have to move out my house because i'm having some major issues that i would not go into but just know it's a whole mess and a half and i don't have a car and i'm having to pay money 60 dollars a day y'all out of my pocket and i still have to pay my car note so imagine you have to pay your car note right now. A blinker would have been nice. Imagine you have to pay your blinker right now. I mean, <laughs> you have to pay a car note, right? Your car note and car insurance. And you also have to pay for a rental. And it's $60 a day. And I've been working my butt off tire as the Dickens, y'all. 12-hour shifts. And it's like something has got to give. So right now, um, I've been finding these jobs. And the jobs have been awesome jobs. And... Um, but you know they're eight to five and because of my situation with help i'm like who gonna pick these kids up because it's just too much and take them to school and all this and that because they on three different sides of town two different sides of town at three different schools so therefore i'm having to find um you know help with that but i'm finna walk my butt into this office and i'm just finna apply and i'm just finna let them know hey i see these jobs available and this is what it is and this is what you do y'all y'all i have i used to do this before and it has worked in the past and it has worked in my favor and i say girl take it back to old school and let's see if this thing works so i was looking real busted earlier and the reason i'm doing this is because of the situation that i'm having where i stay and because of the situation i'm having with my car i have to do a separate video about what happened with my car i have not had my car since november the 30th and it is december the 27th uh, my car was stolen on november 30th brand new car i had my car literally for three months and it was stolen out of my driveway at my house so you know anyway <laughs> uh, so at any rate um I, ha I have a lot of things going on like we need our cars to transport we need a car period you need a job right but i may have to quit my job like asap right like right now and you need a house to live in and right now it's looking like <laughs> all three of them are getting taken away from me like right under my feet and i'm smiling y'all but this has been an ordeal so i said okay girl you need to do what you gotta do so i'm off today I'm off today and so I'm finna just make this thing happen. Now for number one, what you need to do in order to get this job, go in there with a smile and your confidence. Cause like right now, I have so much going on and everything, like when I try to take five steps ahead, I feel like I'm getting 15 steps behind, but I can't let that stop me. Cause if I go in there, first of all, I'm going in there selling myself, right? Just like as if I'm trying to sell a product or I'm trying to sell my business to somebody. I'm trying to sell myself. So like, right now i'm having to go in there with my confidence on a thousand so i don't have time to be thinking about the what else because i'm a good like i have a freaking awesome experience and everything so i have been finding administrative jobs so fyi anybody that have administrative if you were ever a clerk in a clerical position if you ever was um working at the front desk somewhere i don't care where what it was for a daycare a cart place i don't care where it was from if you ever worked there you have this experience child y'all i am finding jobs as a freaking administrative assistant for twenty dollars eighteen dollars nineteen twenty one dollars an hour 
where they do that at so <laughs> you ain't gotta go to school you get your experience and you find these jobs so, the second thing is going there with a smile your smile is everything okay i can change a person's mood with my smile somebody trying to give you a hard time a hard day like this lady was so nasty to me this morning but i just you know i didn't stoop down on her level i just stayed nice and she kind of changed her tone with me so like your smile and your demeanor is everything when you go in trying to look for these jobs okay all right so you we already mentioned two things okay so next thing make sure let me put my charger in y'all make sure you are going in there looking professional now listen i first impressions are everything especially if you're going somewhere where you have to dress professional a nursing profession they want to make sure you know you look good you're going to be clean you're representing them because this is through a staffing agency that i found so you're going to be representing the staffing agency you and also the company you're going to be working at so you want to make sure you know that you're going to look good and clean they don't want you coming in there wrinkled roll out the bed put on some jeans and a wrinkled shirt you know i don't believe in going nowhere for that like that i don't believe going nowhere asking for a job i don't care if you're working for a fast food restaurant i believe you go somewhere and you look nice and you look professional so this is what i have on today mm -hmm. with some flats i normally wear heels but look i was just trying to get this thing done but i'm going in there looking professional first impressions are everything i'm also going in there y'all they have some awesome nurse positions that i found and I applied for it. But it's like their website is kind of weird. So I'm like, bump all this junk. It's like no difference in going into like a Randstad place, an Apple One type place, Kelly Services. So that's where I'm that's where I'm going in there with my resume, with my portfolio over here. Okay. Um, so anyway, I'm also going to be applying for some administrative assistant jobs. I love clerical work. If you didn't know my last job, I worked in an office. The last job before that, I worked in the office as a nurse. You can work in the office as a nurse. Check out my videos. I have videos up about different positions that you can do as a nurse. If you are a nurse watching this, or a CNA, or a CMA, a, a medical assistant, um, are you a nurse? You can find jobs um, working in the office. I love clerical work, y'all. I have always done it. That those are my first jobs that I have had. Um, while i went into the into the workforce so i love clerical as well so make sure you go in there with an awesome personality because if you're applying for a job like this you're gonna be the first thing that people see don't oh i cannot stand when i go into a business and these and these um receptionists are so freaking rude they act like they are the freaking ceo and cfo and you know they are the it they now you are the ish you should always walk around like you are the ish but you don't act like you know, like, uh, -uh you don't, what you need it, what you want to apply for this job for, we ain't hiring, you know, that's, that's uncalled for, let's be professional, like, in 2020, let's stop this job, like, let's stop being nasty towards each other, let's stop acting, you know, hateful, let's stop killing each other, you know, let's stop, let's, let's be cordial, okay, it's going to take us as a community, we're going to, we're, especially my age, I'm in my 30s, like, we are the ones that are going to be running, we are running the world right now, and we're going to be in the future, when the people above us get older so let's act like we got some sense and some home training okay i'm off my rent and any <laughs> anyway you know go in there and, and sell yourself that's the number one thing well why should we hire you you know tell them why they should hire you like you're the freaking bomb like you have experience you know and so th that that's that's my video like and this is just the beginning of the video because I'm going to come back on here and I'm going to tell y'all if I got the job. But y'all got to stay tuned to see because I just have faith in myself and I have gotten jobs this way in the past. You know, I mean, I just go in there and I'd be like, hey, listen, I'm looking. I see y'all are hiring for this and look at my resume. I had this experience for that. So I'm about to take these kids, they food and I'm like the place ain't even that far from my house. That's why I threw on these clothes. Now the place ain't like way across town even if it was but the place is like not far from my house at all so that's why i'm like man let me run up here and, and see what they got going on and i'm gonna take this scarf off my head y'all it's just holding this natural hair down you know i had to slit this stuff up in a bun because i had it under a turban and it was looking kind of you know all poofy and stuff like that but i had to slit this stuff down because you know hey we got we gotta look we gotta look good we, we gotta look put together first impression is everything okay all right um also this this sweater i'm gonna give y'all let y'all know about what i have on so like this sweater is freaking like oldest 
dirt it doesn't even really button like you see this button is holding on like it's holding on okay this shirt let me zoom in so y'all can see the details of this shirt i got this cute shirt it's sleeveless that's why i had this sweater on with it with the ruffle detail okay it's just so cute y'all with the pearls y'all know i'm dainty like that and y'all will see this um shirt a lot like on my instagram and also in my thumbnails because this is a shirt i normally wear to interviews because it's a freaking conversation starter and um it's just so cute and it was three dollars from rainbow and i got on some black slats they're actually like capris but i don't know they like they're like cute black slats they stop like mid calf i wouldn't know i wouldn't wear these to an interview just so you know i'm just wearing them because i needed some black pants to throw on because i don't know where my other stuff is. i don't know my black skirt child i need to hang up my clothes that's gonna be another thing in 2020 i'm hanging up clothes y'all okay i'm not finna be washing all these clothes and don't hang them up yeah guess women right y'all do that y'all let me know in the comments if y'all do that <laughs> i'm gonna start after i take these clothes out the washing dryer like i'm gonna be putting them up y'all i'm gonna make sure i'm putting these clothes up but at any rate let me go right quick. I just left the place to get the girls their food. And I'm about to drop this food off to these kids. And then I'm finna fly over here to this place. You know, I got to say my prayers. And I have to get things together in my head. And y'all do that too. Like, y'all pray. Pray for everything. You know what I'm saying? Prayer prayer changes things. Even though it's been since July. I've been having this issue with my house. Um, It's been since August. And I've been having this issue with the job situation and getting help. Hell, it's been since when i got this job last year in december i've been having issues so y'all just make sure that you stay prayerful because even if your situation don't change in a month in six months or a year like it will change you know i know it's gonna change and i'm gonna be like y'all remember when <laughs> so i'll see y'all real quick real shortly i'll see y'all all right